Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here, and uh, don't be fooled. This is not Veronica. No! Yeah, Serena sees through this. I think everyone does. Flee, foul phantom, dark intrusion. Light dispel this black illusion. Veronica would never have said such awful things. Go on, be off with you. I don't know about that. She was kind of uh, mouthy. But yeah, I don't. I don't. I, she wouldn't have told us all to die. She wasn't that bad. <laughs> she didn't regret a thing. I know she didn't. She died with hope in her heart. Hope that we would bring back the light. Um, this is your doing. I sense it. Oh, it's got to be Jasper. Jasper! Show yep. yourself! Time for the evil villain music that I love. <laughs> Still, you speak of hope? Of light? Even now, with one of your little band beyond saving, your faith is sickening. Uh, well, we've killed five of the Spectral Sentinels. This is probably one of my favorite pieces of music from this game. Come here seeking an audience with my master, I suppose. Well, I'm afraid I shall have to disappoint you. Oh yeah, like you're gonna stop us. I would ask you to leave politely. But we both know you are too pig-headed to listen. And besides, I would not want your journey to have been in vain. Like we were gonna come all the way to this castle to meet and fight and stop Mort again. And then have Jasper show up and be like, Hey, could you guys just leave the castle? And we'd be like, Oh yeah, let's, we'll just leave the castle. And, and, you know, we'll be about our merry way. No, that's, that's not what we're here to do. <laughs> he does have the silver orb. <laughs> Gaze upon me and despair! I have surpassed you at last! Fool! You have surpassed me in wickedness and naught else! Bold words indeed! But you will pay for them with your life! I shall offer up your broken bodies in tribute to Almighty Mordigan! You know, maybe I should have forged the Drusillian armor and helmet and had, uh, don't I have one of those things already? And had... Well, that was rude. Calls for Beckney, you're not allowed to do that. That's not okay either. Okay, well, his backup has to die first. Let's start getting things pumped up. Yeah, I can have... I can have Rab heal. Oh, another thing I did... Did I do it yet? I don't think I did it yet. I think I do it after this battle. I'm gonna give Rab the Sage's Stone instead of, uh, Jade. Just because I really need Jade focused on damage dealing, and I'm sure the final DOS. Final DOS? Final boss is gonna be in somewhat of an endurance battle. So instead of spending 32 MP on Rab's uh, multi heal, I would rather use a Sage's Stone. It might be a little bit weaker, but uh, I do want to focus him on using some, like, the Spirit Bombs 
to uh, inflict some uh, lower lightning resistance, because that will go well with Jace as well. And uh, Sap works on this guy. Which means we're really just going to be able to pump out the damage. Yeah, when you can uh, Sap and... Between Sap and Oomphal, you can uh, really put out a bunch of damage on enemies. And he's pepped up now already. Well. Uh, you're not using breath attack, so let's just, um... Can I lower your attack power? No, that's, that's not gonna work. Okay. And just because he is pepped up, I, that's why I go for the multi-heal here. I just did a multi-heal. Okay, so she's starting to lose name. That's fine, though, because we're not going to use her for physical attacks anyways. Yeah, Jade's upset. Wow, I love that. Between the both of them, they're... Wow, we've already got him in the, uh, yellow. Okay, maybe I didn't give him a Sage of Stone yet. I think I do that. I must do that after this battle. Uh, but yeah, being an endurance battle, I want him to have MP for doing other things. Uh, so I'll be using Sage of Stone when it's feasible. I mean, I know it's not as good as a multi-heal, not quite as strong, but, uh... Should be decent. Serena, we have to reestablish some buffs here. Oh, and I think we, yeah, we have to reestablish Sap. Oh, be quiet, you. Uh, how much am I going to push my lucky? You know, he's really low on health. I'm just going to go for the kill here. At least attempt to. Normally wouldn't be recommending this thing because, uh... Oh, we got him. But yeah, he was, he was low on life, so I played a little bit riskier there at the end. A nice amount of experience. I mean, it's no Metal King Slime, but, uh... Pretty good. Level 52. Don't know if that's going to be enough. How? I am first among demons. Supreme commander of the Spectral Sentinels. How could mere humans defeat me? Because we're stronger. Oh, Hendrik just ignoring him and walking right past. Again, you surpass me. Again, you outdo me. Again, you you leave me behind. Hmm. The more you bathe in glory. The more brightly you shone, the more I receded into shadow. Do you know what it was that I always wanted? I wanted to be like you. So you responded by doing, you know, the opposite of Hendrik? That bit doesn't make sense, but I was not expecting Jasper to admit something like that. Now it's kind of a shame that we couldn't, you know, save Jasper. Uh, with that, we have all the orbs.
and uh, oh, we have uh, yeah, we have level ups to attend to. Oh, we finally found a uh, surprise skill point boost on Jace's board here. Here, full heal. Interesting. I could get that. I, I don't think I need that right now. It could be occasionally useful, but uh, yeah, I'm I'm more interested in those passive buffs. And actually what I'm going to do, and yeah, we're just going to eat back here, uh, I'm going to go back to the beginning and drop a save. Especially because I'm, I'm half expecting to lose to the, to Mortigan the first try. Uh, typically in Dragon Quest games, especially my first attempt on the game, I, I tend to lose to the final boss. So I'm, I'm kind of expecting to lose and then have to uh, re, restart or do some level grinding off camera. Uh, if that's the case, I'll, well, then, then that's what I'll do. But uh, we can at least see some cutscenes. We can start the final battle, and uh, well, we got to get back up there again. So we'll get our ride armor. And yeah, we kind of have to go through the beginning here. Good thing we can still uh, run past those guys. And we might as well pick up all these uh, jewels again, just in case I need any of them for crafting in the post game whatever that all entails all right and we have way more enemies than i was hoping to fight here ride armor and we'll waft our way to the top again. This is like the third time that we're doing this on camera. I mean, I know I could have just, uh, you know, cut the, did some editing and cut this out, but, uh, you know, we're not, we're not going to get to show the whole battle with Morgan anyways and cut scenes and all that, so we need, we need this thing that we call time filler. Plus, I'm half expecting having, like, another dungeon, or at least somewhat more of a dungeon, uh, at this Palace of Malice thing. I guess we'll find out the answers to that as well, if that's going to be happening. this big empty hallway. It's kind of a 
not much of a point of having that there. Other than just to be another time waster. This room actually looks pretty cool. I'll give it that. Alright, yeah, that's where I switch the Sage's Stone around. Okay. Well, cutscene here. I sense pure evil on the other side. It can only be him. Also, I guess this is a teleporter right to Mordigan. The time has come to face him. Very well. Um. Hey, no fair. Let me. Well, this isn't good. Can't move. Oh wait, you guys are all dead. And we have the orbs. How are you even doing this? Oh, there's a Lizarin, because he's so big. He's just on the left side. <laughs> when I was first playing this, I, I didn't see a Lizarin right away. And I'm like, wait a minute, where is he? Did you think you had bested me? I, Jasper, Supreme Commander of the Spectral Sentinels. You died. We already beat you. Uh, didn't we beat all of these guys? How can they be back? Love this music. <laughs> oh, Hendrik, your face. Now you will see who has left who behind. And how is Gildiga here if that's uh, really me? face my master memory. But know that you will do so. Alone. Your friends here will be staying with us. Um, I don't think so. Uh, yeah, there's no way we're gonna fight the final boss no, alone. You shall not go alone. Yeah, luminary powers I activate. I am the luminary sword, his shield, his unswerving companion. We all are. We're in this together. If we face Mordigan, we face him as one. Think I'm missing my chance to get revenge for my Eleanor after all these years. You've another thing coming. Don't worry, darling. I'm with you all the way. We're going to bring smiles and sunshine back to the world if it's the last thing we do. Yeah, yeah, that's the important thing yes. to remember here. I promised Veronica I would finish this, and that's a promise I mean to keep. You heard. We're in this together. I'm not leaving anyone to suffer alone ever again. I'm supposed to help the Luminary, and that means to the bitter end. <laughs> oh, Luminary powers activate. We're all going Super Saiyan here. And they died a second time. Just one more chance, please. Didn't you have your just one more chance? It is over, Jasper. Be still. Oh, Hendrix going to have more to say here. <laughs> no, I cannot die yet. I have yet to surpass you. <laughs> You speak of surpassing me. But in truth, it is I who always followed in your wake. 
I love the interaction between the these two here. Me on. The light that guided me. Without you, I would never have become myself. How is it that you never knew? Jasper's kind of uh, stunned about that. Yeah, and really a shame that we never. Uh, that we couldn't save Jasper. Aside from that whole sequence between uh, Jasper and Hendrik there, which they could have had that conversation back in the other room as well. Um, I didn't get the whole, let's bring back the six, Mordigan or the five, the six, six spectral sentinels, just for one little cutscene, and nothing really came of it, you know? But it did uh, pad the video time long enough to uh, let me end things here. Or we can teleport. Oh, of course, we have one more, uh... Oh, yeah, we're gonna see this. Okay. The Seat of Shed... That's, that's definitely the end spot. Okay. Well, that answers that question. So next time, I guess we're gonna be taking on Mordigan. We'll run down this empty hallway so we don't have to do it next time. And I will see you then.